Williston and Williams County say expanding health care access is key to population growth. Williston State College will soon train students interested in going into health care fields. Michael Anthony reports. With financial support from the state legislature, Williston State College will build a nearly $37 million medical training facility. College President Burnell Hearning says this facility will keep health care workers in the region versus having them finish their education elsewhere. And then complete years three and four and any other clinical work that they would do in person here right in Williston. We want them to be here in person and they want to be here in person. Of the new classes for the new facility, behavioral health is one in high demand locally. Clinical director for Eckerd Youth Home, Dr. Leah Hoffman, says the facility could help them get more workers. The one thing that keeps Eckerd from growing is, as a behavioral health provider, would be staff. And so we, are, we can get as big as we want to as long as we have the staff to provide the services. Paramedics and EMS courses would also benefit ambulance services around the region. It gives us at least a chance to make sure that we have people that know what they're getting into when they go back to their communities and man the ambulance services. The college and JLG architects held public forums last week to discuss the possible designs for the facility. They hope to begin construction by next fall and be open in 2025. In Williston, I'm Michael Anthony reporting for your news leader. Hearing says the school plans on offering several courses like behavioral health, CMA, and office support staff next year before the new facility is open.